Now, CBS4 weather. I'm meteorologist Dave Warren in for Craig tonight, and our temperatures will not be as cool. They're still just above 60 degrees. Uh, we've had lows into the upper 50s, middle 50s. Tonight should be maybe right about 60, possibly a degree or two below, especially in some of the areas here. Already down to 58 degrees in Palmetto Bay. It was into the mid 50s there last night. So you may notice it's not quite as cool tomorrow morning. In the Keys, we have temperatures into the mid 60s in Key West, Kajo Key and Marathon is also at 63 degrees. Satellite radar shows high clouds coming across the area. Relatively dry, uh, here, considering what we're watching just to the north, put the radar on there and you see a few showers continuing to move from west to east, not working their way south. High pressure remains in control, but it's on the move. It's sliding off to the east here. Uh, so eventually some of that activity might try to work its way south and we could put a few showers in the forecast this weekend. No showers tonight, though. Temperatures are into the mid 60s. They'll drop down to about 60. Just a pleasant night with a light breeze. And uh, that's what you'll wake up to tomorrow morning. We'll say seasonably cool. A few areas were already into the upper 50s. It's about where they'll stay. So maybe a brief chill tomorrow morning. Tomorrow afternoon, maybe even a little warmer. Temperatures could try to get up to near 80. Close today in West Kendall, and a few places may warm up a degree or two tomorrow afternoon. A cold front, another one. It's moving across the northeast. There's those squalls of snow coming off the Great Lakes, but that cold air pretty much going right out to the Atlantic. High pressure building in here, not here. If it was here, it'd bring some of that cold air right down the Florida Peninsula. But in this case, the front works its way in from the northeast. Our breeze comes in off the ocean. It'll increase a bit, but does little to impact our temperatures. In fact, it could keep it from getting too cool overnight. You may notice that the boating conditions, while they're good now, they're good tomorrow, they're good Saturday, that back backdoor cold front late this weekend, southeast may, wind gusts may go, go up to about 20 knots. So it could create some rough seas there. Two foot seas tomorrow, south to southwest wind, five to 10 knots. With that southwest wind, we could see temperatures climbing up to near 80 degrees. We'll be close, extended forecast cast has the breeze coming in with a few showers Sunday and Monday. Then we're warm and dry next week, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Elliot.